What is up, everybody? It is me, Savage Coasters, and I hope you're doing well because I'm doing f***ing awesome. Today, we are here to talk about one of the least discussed and most unusual coasters of the 2019 season, Panic Coaster Bakdan, located at Tokyo Dome City. Tokyo Dome City is one of the most interesting parks you can visit around the world. Located in the heart of Tokyo, Tokyo Dome City is home to one of the most famous coasters in the world, Thunder Dolphin. Located in the La Croix area of the park, Thunder Dolphin is an intimate hypercoaster standing at a height of 262.5 feet tall. The coaster is famous for its interaction with the surrounding buildings and nearby Ferris wheel. Ever since 2011, when the park's spinning coaster, Spinning Coaster Mahime, closed down, Thunder Dolphin was the park's only roller coaster. That is, of course, until this new coaster sprang up out of nowhere. Named Panic Coaster Bakdan, this was a ride that flew under the radar for the majority of the enthusiast community until it opened in late March of 2019. Panic Coaster Bakdan is a Gerslauer family launch coaster, home to four separate launches. This coaster starts off by dimming its lights as a cartoon bomb bounces into the screens surrounding the station. As the bomb finally explodes, riders are launched out into the ride to navigate a few turns and small drops. That leads into the second launch, which is a small tire boost that gives the train enough speed to finish its twisting layout. As riders enter the station, they quickly realize that they are facing the wrong direction and that the train has entered the station backwards. The bomb reappears but starts to bounce even more violently. Once the bomb explodes, riders experience launches number 3 and 4 as they take the entire ride layout again but backwards. This time, while traveling through the ride's show building, there are lots of small little flashing lights and loud music that flood the area. After going through the ride a second time, the ride is finally over. Tokyo Dome City describes the ride as an indoor roller coaster that moves forwards on its first run and backwards on its second. From complete darkness, riders enjoy the roller coaster as you experience eye-opening features ranging from a light show to projection screens showcasing comical explosions of bombs. It is perfect even for the kids. After hearing about this ride, I immediately fell in love with the idea. I have always been a fan of family shuttles, whether they are made by Vacoma or Gerslauer. I found Fire Chaser Express at Dollywood to be a great family coaster, and Rewind Racers at Adventure City to be a coaster that was fun to ride, even though it's so small. I really like the idea of having a coaster go through its layout twice once forward and once backwards, as it gives riders a whole new experience while still being on the same coaster. I would love to see more small parks get rides similar to this. And that about wraps it up for today. What do you think of this new innovative family coaster? Sound off in the comments below. I'd still love to hear what you think. Trust me, I sounded really petty on the Hakuge one, but I really do want to hear what you have to think now. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications so you will be the first to see what I upload next. If you want to follow me around on all of my various coaster trips, follow my Instagram account at savage.coasters for even more content. See ya!